you guys talk about Bambi TV, guys, you're going to be reacting to when modern women get home with instant tweets. Guys, let's get straight into this. Disclaimer, the comments made in this video are intended solely for entertainment purposes and are not intended to harm or offend anyone. You don't qualify for the man that you want, you. I know that you have you certain habits. You don't know me. You don't know you me. I don't have to know you. Here are two instances when modern women get humbled instantly. Episode 2. Starting with this 32-year-old woman who's a model and believes she deserves the top 1% men. Do you want a high-value guy? Say it again? Do you want a high-value guy? Yeah. You do? Okay. Do you think you can negotiate with a high-value guy? No. Okay. Who do you think has the power and control when you're with a high-value guy, you or him? Together. He's a team. Okay. <laughs> She's a the answer is actually he has the power, not you. So... I mean, if anything, it's not my situation. I don't want to to have a guy that tell me what I have to do or what I have to think that's or what single. I have to feel. That's why you're yeah. single. Okay. You know? She wants her own mind. Okay. Well, maybe. No, it, it, that's why. Well, you, yeah, maybe. You but here's the thing: if you're with a guy like that, they're but gonna they're gonna be masculine and they're gonna expect you to have certain. You know, you're gonna have to follow him. Yeah, but the question is that it's a degrading. Question. I I don't accept that. You don't accept either one. No. Guys, I really don't like when men put it in the way that. When you're with a rich man, he's gonna control your life. Like, it's not like rich men actually respect their wives, but like, even if your life is gonna be like concentrated around his, but does not mean you won't live yours. Like, I feel it's a team. Like, marriage is is a partnership. It does not mean like the man's gonna control. Like, they are making it. They are taking it to the extreme. I'll see that, but like, it's mostly not like that. A guy cheating on this you. This is my this is my my position. You know, she contradicts her own statement by saying that she wants a high value man, but won't listen to his commands. Her inconsistent responses shows how delusional she really is. What is more common, you or a high value man? Mm. Successful man with money, status. What's more common, Un you or him? Que tiene dinero. But. Huh? B both people. You can find both. No. Can... What is more common, you or him? What is more common where? In the world. In the world. You? A girl like you? Or him? I don't know. Okay. I don't know. I'll I don't, ha I don't have the answer. I'll I'll I don't have the, the facts. I'll give you the answer. Facts. You know? You, you want to make false I don't like to talk about anything about I don't know. Okay. You well, know? I will tell you. You are more common, not him. He is rare. You are not. Because here he can choose another girl. I don't care. Okay, that's fine. You can choose another girl. <laughs> you know, I don't need to accept that because I love myself. So I have to accept the things that I don't like it because I can be by myself. It is... I, I prefer to stay by myself than accept okay. that shit. You okay. know. So you would prefer to stay by <laughs> yourself that. than have a man. Yeah. Okay. okay well, cool. as long as you're okay with that, <laughs> that's but fine. The reality is, you're 31 years old. Okay. I don't care and, the reality. No, uh, you ask me what I think. Okay, but I'm telling you what you think might not be the best way to think given your circumstance. You're 31 years old. You have a profession that a lot of guys might say, mm, I don't know. So you don't really have the power to negotiate with a higher status man. It's his way or the Maybe highway. Maybe the power is not only about the money. It's what is in your mind, you know? That sounds great, but you're not going to date a homeless guy with a great mind. <laughs> Myron completely shatters her argument with his questions. However, she never accepts the true reality, and her arrogant behavior will only continue like this. You would you be said? homeless if you had a great mind. Yeah, yeah like, you right. can say that. That sounds great, but you're not going to date a bum. The man will mind. lead the relationship, basically. Yeah, I mean, as long as you're okay with being single, but that mindset is not conducive to finding a higher status man, is what I'm trying to say. If I am in a relationship... I don't accept that. I don't negotiate that. And then they're just going to get a younger, more attractive girl that will accept that. And so, you'll be single. Well, mm. I just have a question. How no. much, like, I don't think how women much... understand. Like, yo, ladies, when you're with a guy that's high value, who you all think that you deserve, by the way, there's no negotiating. It's there's my not. way or the highway. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He's going to have other bitches. You gotta get with her. He's gonna have other women. Let's do it. And that's how it goes. Straight up. Let's do it. They're not gonna sit there and be like, oh, like, what do you think about this and blah, blah, blah. If he does that, you should thank God. But most of the time, they're just gonna lie to you. That's what you're saying. say ridiculous shit like that. If I only choose a man only for the money, for sure I have to negotiate that. But I don't choose a man only for the money. Oh, what do you want? You know? What do you want then? A good hair, a good feelings. Spiritual energy. You know? Pure soul. Yeah. yeah. Will you date a man that makes less money than you? Say it again? 
Will you date a man that makes less money than you? No. Oh. <laughs> and a man, so a man with right. money is gonna have multiple <laughs> women. I can't even lie. Like, yeah, yeah, but nobody knows know it's gonna have one. Nobody knows something. You know something. Know. Know know. you know so hey, hey, now, hey, hey, hey. now the people, now the people is working in both things. You can, you can work in your spiritual lifestyle and in your, in your money too. Why not? So you need you both. So you can. Hmm? Yeah. Why not? So you need even more then. Why not? So she needs even more. So you I've, want a guy I, with money that's gonna sit there and negotiate with you? Say it again. You and yeah, right. <laughs> it's a headache. All right, okay, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna move yeah, on. Yeah, like, what do you? you, you, you I'll just be honest. With you. you don't qualify for the man that you want. I'm just gonna say it straight up. Right. You don't know me. No, based on you your actions, know me. I don't have to know you. I know that you have certain you don't habits know me. and mannerisms. You don't qualify you for the don't man that know you want. Me. I don't have to know you. Okay, I'm telling you, you okay, don't qualify boss. for the man that you okay, want. Okay, boss. This kind of women never learn until they fall flat on their faces. And if you thought this was unbelievable, then this next clip will surely leave you amazed. <laughs> After Fresh and Fit podcast invited this 30-year-old female stripper who was now divorced and single, Myron's curiosity peaked as he delved deeper into her past, uncovering the truth about her ex-husband. But to be honest, my, my ex-husband actually been complaining about me going to the club for work. But why I did that? Because at the beginning, I was staying at home. But then when I see that there is no responsibility, there is no like, uh, you know, he doesn't think about me first. Then I start going and making my money back. I would say if he told you not to go to the club, he's definitely thinking about you first. Was he, uh, I want to say, <laughs> no, you didn't get lifestyle? It. That you wanted was he giving you the house at the beginning when i we first get married i i been home uh wife i stay home i, I do. cook i clean, I clean yeah. <laughs> 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 but then i realized that there is nothing for me there is just uh men using me like uh, no 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 hold on did he pay the, did he pay the bills for you he pay like i move into his house so he always pay what bills. are you worried about as soon as he, let's say, get lose his interest or I do something wrong, he can just kick me out of the house. So, but did he kick but you did out? He? Yeah, eventually he did. No, no. After you at the club or before? No, no. Okay, before the club, we start having complications. Like he's being aggressive, and he he explained that. Why was that, he being aggressive? Okay, he said that I'm losing respect or whatever. Maybe I don't know. I don't remember. It was a couple of years mm, ago. Now she doesn't remember. Yeah, no, remember. no, no. no. Yeah. This was in America. This is in the Miami. yeah United States. Okay. Unlike the first woman, she found a high value man, but somehow still managed to fumble the opportunity. When confronted, she claimed, he has been aggressive, a phrase frequently used by many modern women when they find themselves exposed. What he's saying, uh, I don't know, I didn't love him enough or, you know what, yeah. he can say whatever, like it's not the truth, it's just like miscommunication. Why was he saying so that? I get it, you were being ungrateful and then he got mad at you because you were going to club no, after No man, I was grateful as I guarantee um, um, if we pull them aside and ask them, yo, what happened? She probably was being ungrateful, disrespectful, annoying, giving him a hard time, etc. So that's when we told her, yo, get the f out the house, bro. Or she's saying, I'm going to go to the club now or some shit like that. <laughs> no, 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 it was a little more complicated. Wait, I, I'll tell you what happened. So he's been constantly in the in the computer. I understand he's a great trading and I was respectful. I tried to, you know, stay away from him and blah, blah, blah. But he he don't. Give me attention at all, maybe. Oh, uh, here we go. Now we <laughs> no, get Fredo, it. Fredo, Fredo, I go to the club. Hold on, Fredo. <laughs> Fredo. If he's a day trader, it takes immense focus and <laughs> Fredo, Fredo, Fredo. day trade. Oh, bro, <laughs> nigga, nigga, straight up. Dude, she was just, she was just annoying. Yeah, he That's has, what it was. He has to work. Focus she was in a room. He can't be like, oh, hey, what because here's the thing. She didn't work. She stayed in the house all day. She yeah. got bored. She wanted attention. Yeah. Because she might maybe she came here from Russia. She didn't have that friends does. like that. So he was like her only like real social situation. But he's always on the computer working. So she gave him a hard ass time and he got annoyed. He was like, yo, what the? F but like, he doesn't want me to have a friend. And as you said, like, like I'm supposed I'm to right. stay at home. I'm right. Okay. She claims that she wasn't receiving enough attention. Mm -hmm. So she started going to the clubs to seek it from other men, despite knowing that her actions were upsetting her husband. But this gets more interesting when the audience forced her to call Fredo, her ex-husband, live on stream. Can you call him right now? Uh, uh, Shit, yeah. Because I'm going to say exactly what you said. Then I'm going to say, is that true? And tell us why the real reason you you can throw out. As a day trader, you need immense focus. 
Yeah. In a room, locked, no noise. She was annoying him. That's trade. straight up what no, it no, was. No, 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 wait. I, I explained one thing because it's important. No, like, no, 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 at the no, first no, time, no, I no, left. No. At the first time, I left so and I he was upset. That's why he divorced me. <laughs> but the second time, I called police because he was aggressive and he did bad things. Oh, That's wow. why. Oh, <laughs> God. Isn't that crazy? Did he go to jail because of that? No, I, I called to his, I called his lawyer because I didn't know, guys. This is my, like... Okay, so well, in my country, if you call police, they're gonna say, "Hey, hey, guys, don't do that anymore," and they leave. Yeah, and in this case, went to jail. yes, that's they took true. him. I was, wow. I was, I didn't know that they're gonna take Hold him. Hold on, did he touch you? Uh, Physically? He, uh, Be honest. To police, I said no, but he, he did. Wait. Not like he's beating me, but you know, like whatever, like something like that. You, she probably pushed him. I'm I'm aggressive too. Yeah. I, yeah, I yeah, yeah. But well, after, on, there's more red flags. flags. She was whooping on him and he pushed her off. There's more red flags in his story. Yeah, yeah, but I became oh, that. Yeah. I became that I... once I lived with him the whole year. I haven't been like that. There's more he... red flags in his story than a Chinese comedy parade, isn't yeah. there? <laughs> Yeah. 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 She's trying to say that you kicked her out the house or that you were a jerk or whatever it may be. Give us the real reason what went down and why you were annoyed by her, why you guys uh, ended up. As things. a day trader. Yeah, as a day trader. Man, she's not easy, man. Yeah. She's <laughs> rusty. <laughs> <laughs> because here's the thing. She's trying to paint you as a crazy guy on here. <laughs> but Fredo, I just go to the club. <laughs> she's rusty. Oh, for, the re- for the record. Oh, no. I already knew that, bro, that you ain't put your hands on her. Yeah, yeah. I never put my hands on her. I always let go free and clear. All that got settled out. I Let me ask you a question. Did she hit you first and you kind of had to get her off you? Uh, she, she, she can get aggressive. She yeah. can get aggressive. She even said that. Mother Russia. I haven't been like that at the beginning. She <laughs> taught me to do that. Like, Zero I teach from him. I learned from oh, him. Now, now it's his fault that you hit him. Okay. <laughs> you All know right. the vibes. Uh, right. No, no feelings, so. Indeed, her statements began to shift. She clearly didn't expect this to happen as she attempted to cast her ex-husband in a negative light. The real story started to emerge as her ex-husband prepared to expose her. What caused you to be like more like, I guess more like demanding? This, because she said she wanted to go work at the, at the club uh, after a while, but what caused her to want to go work at the club if you're, if you're like paying all her, all her bills? What caused that? She said, that she, she said the club is her first love. Oh! Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. 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 So bro, you're paying the bills to take care of her, and she wants to go work at the club still? That's amazing. <laughs> I bet. Not to be a victim in this, you know, but you know, I had a lot of patience with her. I, I had a lot of patience, and it got to the point where she just was dating other men. <gasps> that's not oh, true. That's wow. not true. That's not true. You know, that's not true. All, about all you guys, she, would date, she wouldn't. Fuck them. I, I have no doubt she she would. Fuck them. But she would still go out on dates, let them take her shopping. Oh, like uh, she was tricking. Yeah. She was tricking. She was pimping. She was yeah. pimping. Yeah. Pimpin'. Oh, that, oh, that was not the whole story from Mother Russia. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. That, that, that wasn't. I know, I know. I'm telling you, this can be deceiving, but, you know. Oh. Oh no, oh. we we knew, bro. Yeah, we yeah. just want to hear your side because girls always lie about know. about the man side. They they put the guys, the bad guy, all oh, blah blah blah. Hey, 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 just hey, ask her this: How how many times did I break up with her? Probably just one time, and that's why we ain't together. But she broke up with me so many times, and I know I know the game. I know how it is. You know, I'm patient. I, you know, she's a woman. You know, I I I know where she's, she's at mentally, woman. but it gets to the point where it's you know you're dating other guys. You're talking I didn't other guys, date him. Not, him. My friend gave me a ride and she like just. Yeah, it's happened after you kicked me out of the house and I have to pay everything myself. Then when I said, and you date bitch 100%. Period. <laughs> go ahead, talk that shit. Yeah. I'm, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, I, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and I'm, I'm going to play the same game. You know, eventually, you know, that's it. I, I can't stay. I can't stay, you know, loyal in that regard because at the end of the day, I'm here at home. I'm trying to make some money, and she's out there, you know. Yeah, we don't live together because 
first of all, we had to sleep in different bedrooms. Voilà. You, 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 impossible to sleep with her in the same room. Wow. Why? Why? Yeah, yeah. She she had her own room. What? She, and, you know, you couldn't make you couldn't make even a peep of noise because then if she would wake up. <laughs> all hell will break. If you enjoyed this video, watch this one and don't forget to subscribe. We oui, man. But I feel there should be a podcast on like men expose. I, I feel why it would be hard for a man to expose, like for you to expose a man is the fact that he's going to complain and say, I did this, I did this, and I feel I fucked up, but I'm sorry about it. But like women, we always want to claim that right, and I feel that's where the problem comes in. Like if you're honest on, yo, I fucked up. I'm sorry. Like it's different than for you to say, nah, I was not wrong. I I did this. He did it, bro. I if I was out, I could have just stood up and left. Like just the, the embarrassment is too much. Like I feel you should always stand with the truth. I feel. The truth will set you free. Now guys, don't think about this. Tell me if you want me to react to more of this. Just like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.